Hi guys, Brooke here, and today we're gonna to be drawing a reindeer from my book, Santa's Reindeer. Let's get started. All right, let's go ahead and find the center of our paper. We're gonna come down and over just a little bit. And right here, we're gonna draw a nice medium sized oval. Now coming off of this side of the oval, I wanna come up, leaving a little space. And right here, I'm gonna draw a nice tall oval. Here we go. And next to that oval, these are the eyes. So I'm gonna draw one more oval about the same size right here. Inside, I'm gonna draw a nice big circle right there. And in that upper corner, I'm gonna draw a good size circle again. Now starting at the top, I'm just gonna draw a little half moon coming around right there. Same thing on the other eye, we're gonna draw a nice good size circle. In that upper corner, we're gonna draw another circle. And then starting right here, I'm gonna draw that little moon that comes around. Now coming right above this eye, I'm gonna start here and I wanna draw a curved line that comes down right by the nose. When we get to the nose, we're gonna start curving around. Now I'm gonna come out here by my ear and I'm gonna curve down and around, coming in to connect. Now, starting right here under this side of the nose, just barely underneath it, I'm gonna create a curved line coming up. Coming in a little bit from the edge, I'm gonna draw a line coming down Then I'm gonna have another line that comes curving up and gets kind of close to that one. And then on the top, I'm just gonna draw a line coming across. Now back up here, I'm gonna start inside of this line and I'm gonna come across touching it and coming out to the side. And coming over here, from this top part, I'm gonna do similar, coming out and up. And I wanna add a little hook to the end of it. And I wanna bring a diagonal coming down. It's got a nice curve to it. And I'm gonna bring it in to attach. Now right here, I just wanna extend this line a little further, so I'm more by the inside of this eye. And I'm gonna draw a line going straight up. I'm gonna curve the top and bring it back down. I'm gonna do another curved line coming up and over. Adding a U-turn at the top and bringing it back down. Another short diagonal, adding a U-turn. And from there, I'm gonna just draw a curve line coming all the way over, almost sideways, leaving a big space here for that ear. Over here, starting right outside this little mountain that we've made, 
I'm gonna draw a little line just curving up. From there, I wanna start just past this line. And I'm gonna do a diagonal coming back in. And I'm gonna add a fat U on top of it. And I'm gonna bring it back in so it's almost even with this one. Once I get it in there, I wanna create another U. And I wanna bring it back out. About the same distance. And I'm gonna add another C, but oh, it ran right into the top. And that's okay. I'm gonna come back down here, leaving a good space right there. And I'm just gonna draw a curve line coming up and over. Starting just inside of that line, I'm gonna draw a line that curves just up and touches the top. Coming back down by his ear, I'm gonna have another line that goes a little more sideways, but it is diagonal and it is curved, it's not straight. And it's about the same length as this one. And then I'm gonna draw a curved line coming out almost straight sideways. And then it's gonna curve up. Starting right here, I wanna draw another diagonal coming up like that. And I'm gonna curve it down to close it off here. From here, I'm gonna curve out this way and then I'm gonna take it up right parallel to that line, leaving a nice good space there. Let's hop on over to the other side. I'm leaving a little space over here from that mountain and I'm gonna draw a diagonal coming out and up. I want about the same gap on these lines that I have over there, so I'm gonna do another one coming out and up, and they're about the same height. From this one, I'm gonna take a diagonal the opposite direction, and I wanna give it a nice curve, making a nice tall C, well, backward C, and I wanna bring it in so it kind of lines up with that one. And then I'm gonna curve it, making it curve back. And then I'm gonna take this one up diagonal and I want it a little longer than this one. So it came out a little further. And then I'm gonna curve it back and connect it at the top. Coming up right here, so it's about as wide as that one is, I'm just gonna do a curved line coming up and running into the top. Down here, I'm gonna start just past my line and I'm gonna do a curved line that comes up and it is gonna run into the side of my page. And I'm gonna jump up, making it as wide as this one, so about even. And again, I'm gonna curve it up and it's gonna run into the side of my page. From here, I wanna curve this way, coming out towards the edge of my paper and then bringing it up. And from here, I'm just gonna add that diagonal to finish it off. Now let's go ahead and come down here and right underneath his mouth right here, starting on our oval, we're just gonna do a straight line coming down then we're gonna come back here, leaving a good two finger space and draw a line coming down and it's gonna curve. From here, we're gonna do a curved line coming over and down. And from here, like it went straight through, we're gonna draw a curved line coming up and over.
right here. I'm gonna draw a curved line that comes down to the bottom of my page. And another curved line coming down to the bottom of my page. And right on this belt, I'm gonna draw a half circle. So we're gonna go ahead and draw a full circle. And inside that circle, I'm gonna draw a dark circle colored in with another dark circle colored in. I'm gonna draw a line crossing down that's slightly curved and another one crossing down slightly curved. And way down here I'm gonna draw half of a circle with another dot right here. And I can only see half of the other dot. Right here, I'm gonna go ahead and add another oval on his nose. All right, now he's looking pretty good. Our reindeer is done. He's, all that's left now is to color. You can write Merry Christmas or a message of your own. Now we simply fold our paper down and we can open it up to find our message inside. And now that our card's complete, Let's go ahead and start coloring. All right, let's see the final drawing. That turned out pretty cute. So that is definitely one of the reindeer from my book, Santa's Reindeer. I hope you had fun doing this art project. I know I did. And I look forward to seeing you for more How to Draw videos. Merry Christmas.